Hello all, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So friends, in today's video, we are going to discuss about an important topic called PIP or PIP. PIP stands for Preferred Installer Program. It is a package manager or installer for Python. So I guess you guys might have heard about NumPy, Pandas, Keras or some other library files. These all library files can be installed easily with the help of PIP. So these library files can even be installed from Chrome or any other browser. So it is a very big process. You have to go to that library file official web page. You have to install the compressed version file. You have to unzip it and you have to copy that file and paste it in the Python folder and you have to run it. It is a very big time taking process. But if you have pip installed in your laptop or PC, you can just install or uninstall these packages with the help of just one line of command. So I'll show you all how to do this in this video itself in a couple of minutes. Before that, a file named bootstrap should be installed in your laptop or PC. If you have installed Python properly, it would be pre-installed in your laptop or else you have two options. Either you can install it with the, you can install it with the help of this command, which I have provided in my article using command prompt or you can reinstall the python i recommend you all to reinstall the python because if this is missing i guess there are some other softwares might be missing so it is better if you reinstall python so now let me show you all how to install pip in your windows so i have already installed pip in my windows so i cannot show it i cannot install it and show you all but you can just enter this one command if you enter this one command in your command prompt it will automatically get installed. It is applicable for both Windows and Mac. So, and next, how to verify PIP is installed or not. For that, I'll show you all whether PIP is installed in my laptop or not. So, same Windows plus R shortcut and CMD command prompt. Then, like PIP help. So, if you get pip not found, that means that pip is not installed. But if you get like this commands install, download, uninstall, freeze. So it means that pip is already installed in your system. So yeah. In maximum cases, when you install pip, it, its path will directly get automatically added at the background or in the Python directory file. Only in rare cases, if your Python is older version, it happens that it does not add, you have to manually add it. So for that, you have to go to the pip installed folder and you have to copy that path and go to system security and environment variables using this image, which I have provided. You can check it out or else I have already made a video on this, which is available in my channel previous video. Please check out my previous video for that previous video for that. After completing all these tasks, also still, if you face any issues like pip not found, then I would recommend you all to uninstall Python completely and reinstall it. Then follow all these steps, then it would definitely get installed in your laptop or PC. So now let us come to the famous topic like how to install pip packages. For that, go to your command prompt. So Use the command pip install. I'm taking an example of numpy. So it's collecting packages from server. It's just 14 MB. It would be installed by now. Sometimes in command prompt, you would face the technical glitches like now I'm facing. So in this case, I would recommend you all to close this tab and again go for command prompt. You can check whether it is installed or not two ways. Number one is again type that same command. Pip install numpy. If you get the message that requirement already satisfied, it means that pip is already installed. You have another way. You can go to you can type pip list. So it will show the list of packages installed in your 
laptop or PC. In this, you can check out for NumPy. So yeah, you can see here NumPy is installed in my laptop successfully. Okay, so now let me show you all how to uninstall any packages from pip. For that, same again, pip uninstall NumPy. I'm taking the same example again. So it is asking for your confirmation whether you want to really uninstall it or by mistake you have entered this command. So I'm giving it yes. So now successfully uninstalled. You can check it out again by using the same command. So you can see here uh, skipping this numpy is not installed. Yeah, and even you can completely uninstall PAP whenever it's not required to you all. So you can use the command pip uninstall pip. So I am not using it because I have many library files installed in my laptop. So if I use it, these all will be deleted. So you can just use only this one command whenever pip is not required to you all. So yeah, that's all for today's video friends. Yeah, I have, you don't need to remind, uh, remember every topics. I have already created an article in Reddit and as well as in Medium. So guys do follow me on medium. So in medium you, you can install medium and create an account in medium. You will get the articles related to tech software comedy and everything. So even you can write the articles and even you can publish the articles. So do install medium and follow me on medium for the regular updates. So that's all for today's video. Do like share and subscribe my channel. Thank you.